I am Dr. Mike Detola, the Director of Clinical Affairs for Dentsply Serona and the Director of Sierra World, and I'm pleased to have today with us uh, a couple of our featured breakout speakers from Sierra World 2016, uh, Dr. Todd Ehrlich and Cindy Barbie. How are you both doing today? We're rocking it. Great, yeah. Mike, how We're are so, you? so excited about uh, Sierra World. Well, we love having you guys there uh, individually and as a one-two punch, a team as well, helping to educate doctors and assistants, you know, the true people who are going to make sure that this all gets done when it's in the office. Uh, can you guys tell me a little bit about the uh, breakout sessions that you're going to be doing at Sarah World 2016? Yeah, sure. So uh, the breakout that we're really excited about is called Seric Aces. And uh, Cindy and I came up with this concept earlier this year on how to enhance the communication between dental assistants and the doctors, because uh, we have a great relationship. And we have no problem <laughs> with uh, communicating with each other, but we've, we've taught a lot of classes and we see the people that can't communicate very well. And so we're gonna set up guidelines on how one dental assistant can approach the doctor and say, you know, like the margins or the interproximal contacts, the embrasures, and we're gonna help facilitate that conversation. Communication is huge between assistants and the doctors, and sometimes we can be a little bit intimidated and you don't wanna say if there's a problem, and so we tend to continue on with the process in which kind of drags things out and the end process is not necessarily what the doctor wants. So we're gonna work with them on being able to communicate. How are we gonna do that? Give them tools to be able to talk to That's their right. doctor and know, you know, how to communicate with margins, how they want their contacts, their occlusion, things like that. I think that's a, a great idea, Cindy, because um, I, if I was an assistant, I would just blame it on the software, I think. I'd say, doctor, nothing personal, but according to the Serex software, your prep sucks. Uh, it's, not, it's not being any more specific than that. That's, that's just what it's saying. But um, I love that you guys are taking this approach and teaching it together. And, and Cindy, I hear a lot of doctors tell me, I would love to get involved with this technology, but I don't think my dental assistants can, can handle it. And I point out to them all the time that when I was at Glidewell, we used to hire designers and stainers and glazers right off the street with no dental knowledge at all. D dispel that rumor. Dental assistants can do this, can't they? Oh, absolutely. You know, I was a huge hands-on assistant. I love my contemporaries packing cord. And so when I first started with Sarek, I was afraid that I wasn't going to be involved as much. And what I have found is it's amazing. I mean, you're not creating a temporary restoration. You're finalizing something great and that looks awesome for the patient. And so to me, it's it's been groundbreaking and huge in my career to be able to be a part of that. Yeah, she was so depressed when I hired her. <laughs> and she, all she was doing was making little provisionals here and there and she's gotten all the way up to making veneers and things. And so it just, you know, it enhances the it way does. they think about themselves. Right. And they take ownership, you know, it really, in, let them get involved and, and assistants can do it. I mean, we rock. Exactly, we exactly. You run the whole office and we all know it. Todd, tell me a little bit about the program you're going to be doing. I think it's one that focuses on posterior quadrants. Yeah, so uh, for the last 10 years, I've taught many doctors on uh, efficiencies on posterior quadrants because, quite frankly, how often are we using CEREC anywhere else other than posterior quadrants? That's, that's the bread and butter. And I've seen a lot of people, you know, take too much time in one area and, and not enough in another. So I break it down into uh, how to make things easier. So let's keep ourselves out of trouble, lay out a formula on, hey, this is easy, this is hard. And then in the hard cases, how can we make these into situations where they're a lot easier, including prep design to imaging sequence to style of design and materials, quite frankly. Well, that's great, and I want to make sure that uh, any of the people who are considering coming out to Sarah World 2016, uh, make sure you get a chance to come out. Make sure you go and see Todd and Cindy's program. You get two magnetic personalities for the price of one when you see these two operate together. I'm so excited that you guys are going to be presenting out there. We look forward to seeing you at Sarah World 2016.